What's up, Aztec Nation? I'm John Schaefer for GoAztecs.com. And although the real 2020 season is underway, we're not going to stop our look back at some of the more memorable games of the past decade. Today, we're going back to the 2019 season and the Aztecs' final regular season game against an old conference rival, BYU. State was 8-3 and, and coming off a loss to Hawaii that kept them out of the Mountain West title game. And because of an injury to their starting quarterback, the Aztecs handed the ball over to a freshman making his first college start. We picked this one up late second quarter. Aztecs down 3-0, went for the first time all night, the offense started to show some life. At some point, you're going to have to throw the ball down the field. Now, they've talked about how Baker likes to throw it down the field. He's got to take a shot at some point outside the numbers and give Matthews, Cody, or Smith a shot. On first down, can something, can someone get it going for San Diego State's offense? It's defense first. Rogar finishes off that play and if I'm on B the run from Williams. If I'm BYU, I'm thinking about using the timeout here in a minute. If you can get a stop here on this third down, if, it, if it's not a throw that they run it again, you're going to use a timeout. Right now, maybe think about using it. Clock running here. And two timeouts left for BYU. On third down, play fake to Williams. Baker, the freshman, on the rollout. Chaz Ayu and company escort him out of bounds along with Kavika Fanua for the Cougars. So now you've effectively, effectively really just eliminated BYU getting the ball back. So you can kind of measure if you're going to go for the field goal here, a couple of underneath completions. Jeff Horton can play it a little bit differently now because there's only a minute six left in the half. With eight seconds to go. What a tight it. First down, Baker throws on the move. Williams, the cat spins away from one tackle. Keeps on trucking. Austin Lee finally gets steamrolled. Enough of Kagan Williams to bring him down. That's a gain of nine timeout. Here's second down. Baker, little pressure coming, throws a dangerous pass in traffic, and it's caught at the 36-yard line. Bellinger makes the grab. It's a gain of six, and the chains move. The toughness by Bell. My mistake, Bell, in the catch. Baker gets thumped. Inside the 35, took a big hit, game three. Here's second down. Isaiah Kafusi, physical hit on Chance Bell. Big play for Baker, the redshirt freshman. On third down, Matthews the catch. That spot looked good, first down. Once the ball spotted, the clock's gonna roll. To the 25 yard line. Game seven. Quick spike. Not bad. You only wasted about five seconds, so you still have a chance to maybe take one shot to the end zone. And we're gonna, you're going to have to kind of throw maybe one towards the back of the end zone. Throw one toward the sidelines. Uh, even if you have one high in, in the back of the end zone. Here's where Bellinger can be a factor. Six foot six. 250 pounds. Uh, he's a guy you got to think about in these situations. And he's lined up right here at the number three wide receiver position in the slot. Don't forget about your tight end. It's always the quarterback's best friend. Second down. Baker throws right on cue. Touchdown, San Diego State to Bellinger. Corey Chavis calls that perfectly. Daniel Bellinger, touchdown, Aztecs. We talked to Parker Houston earlier in the week, Dave, and he talked about the potential. He said this kid has more potential than Kahali Waring, who was a draft pick by the Dallas Cowboys. And if he ends up as a third-round pick, he'll be happy. Now, Riza has the PAT for San Diego State. And finally, Aztec fans here on senior night, something to cheer about offensively. 
for the home team. Well, they're just going to run over. It's called a bend over. And some people call this a, a deep over route. He runs at number three. They're playing zone. So Austin Lee is the only guy that can make a play. It's, it's designed to attack three deep zone where everybody has one third of the field, a safety in the two corners. It's an excellent play call by Jeff Horton. And Bellinger is a guy who, when I watch film, you can see why he played basketball in high school, ran track. He was on the 4 by 100 team. He was an all-state linebacker in high school. He had 131 tackles as a senior at Palo Verde High School in Nevada. Uh, he's a player that has a lot of potential. Good job by Jeff Horton getting him involved in late in this second quarter. Third touchdown catch, sophomore from Vegas, and the first career touchdown pass for Carson Baker. A redshirt freshman from right here in San Diego, Helix High School, only three miles from the San Diego State campus. Aztecs held that 7-3 lead at the half, and with their first drive of the second half, they added on. Over center. Jasmine, the ball carrier. Chase Jasmine, and we'll see Bell, we'll see Kagan Williams, and some of Jordan Bird. In the second half, Chase Jasmine, the junior from here in California, he's got a 100-yard game to his credit. One second down, Jasmine, first down ends up. Chase Jasmine has the edge. Warner eventually pushes him out of bounds. Big pick up San Diego State. It's a chain mover and 17 yards for the Aztecs. Well, this offensive line, and this is a draw concept, and you got to get the block from Cal Spaulding, number 71. Anytime you have a draw, you're given a fake pass set for your offensive lineman. And then all of a sudden, you hand it off, and a pretty good job by Isaac Lassard leading up as well. Bella Carey, now bended by Warner, back in the lineup, Troy Warner. Senior from San Marcos, California. Here's second down. Baker. Smith, connection. And a first down for San Diego State. Kobe Smith the grab along the sideline. And this is an outstanding catch. He runs the speed out again. It's a pretty good break by Heron. Look at him catch the back of the ball. So you got to wonder, I guess, when he gets control of this. Right there, now he has control. He gets that one foot down. Pretty good throw, a little bit low that time, but that's a hard throw from Baker to the outside lanes. Numbers for Baker, not 100 yards yet, but efficient. On first down, Bell has the carry. Dropped there by Kabika Fanua. Over centers Baker. Hands off, Bell carries. Progress stopped at about the 29. Gain of two. Big play. Baker delivers. Tackle made on Smith. Wilgar has the open field play on Kobe Smith. And it's a gain of two. That's a really good tackle. And for a former walk-on to have the kind of year that he's had, you got to be excited, really, in, in terms of not only Eliza, Tuiaki, but also Kalani Satake because that tackle sets up a tough field goal here. A rise up from 44. Well, he's got enough range to make this. Got it! Just inside the upright. The draw. It's <laughs> just enough. Toyota Thon is on. Now's the time to get a great deal on Tacoma. Wrap four, Camry, and more. I'll take it. I'll get this wrapped up for you. I wish I hadn't just unwrapped it. <sighs> now you can drive home a sleek new 2021 Corolla LE with a low $189 a month lease or get $1,000 cash back. We make it easy. Toyota Thon is on. Come in today. Toyota, let's go places. Aztecs held that 10-3 advantage heading into the fourth quarter when a pair of freshmen looked like seasoned veterans as State put more points on the board. On the other side, Carson Baker, uh, I think he's done what they've asked him to do, and that's the big thing for him coming into this game. Uh, you understand how this team plays football. It's about possessions and time of possession. 
on first down. Kagan Williams, sophomore Cedar Hill, Texas, gets the carry. On second down. Baker, play fake. Deep ball, Matthews. A just makes a great catch. Jesse Matthews, team's second leading receiver, brings it in, gain of 33. Well, that's the first time we've seen a deep shot. He looks off the safety very well in the middle of the field and works Isaiah Herring on the outside. Look at the extension from Matthews. Shortstop in baseball in high school. He also played point guard on the basketball team. First down. I think he'll be fine. Williams stays busy. Spins away from the tackle of Kyrus Tonga and Isaiah Kafusi. That's good news for the Aztecs, Amanda. Thanks for that. Go route, deep ball. Matthews again has a great catch for San Diego State. This guy is a walk-on. Jesse Matthews gain of 32. Uh, this guy is it. And look at that throw. Wow. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, I, I tell you what, I don't want to say it's a quarterback controversy, but if I see another throw like this one, it's a quarterback controversy. I mean, Baker, you, you watch this high school tape at Helix, and you can see some of this stuff, but when those are some passes against man coverage on the money, dimes. First down, Kagan Williams. A cutback. First contact, Isaiah Kafusi. <laughs> Second down. Baker going to run with it. And slides in front of Diane Gawolku, who's not wanting more contact from the star uh, BYU corner. Baker, third down. Scrambling. And a redshirt freshman with Wilgar in hot pursuit. Steps out of bounds. Which is a pretty headsy play for yeah. a quarterback making his first career start. It's a loss of two. Especially after those two throws we saw earlier on this drive, particularly the second one particularly. But uh, now it comes down to a more dependable field goal kicker, I might say, in Matt Ariza. Uh, he had the big miss against Hawaii, but he's been generally more consistent, particularly working these hash marks. This from 27, one for one so far in the game for the freshman from here in San Diego. He's got two. That's a 10 point game. Here's Wilson, steps into the throw. Mm. Simon the catch, big hit. Mm. Trenton Thompson with a pop on Micah Simon. This reminds me of the Nevada game. He came across and had a big hit against Caleb Fossum, who we covered earlier this year. From Nevada, knocked him out of the game. Shumway has the catch. Hall hanging on for dear life as a tackle with some help from Andrew Alecki. First down, Cougars desperate for points. Wilson airs it out for Mill, broken up last second. Incomplete inside the 10. Marku on coverage. I think this kid's going to put himself in a position to get drafted, Dave. And I really mean that. Now, he's a little bit thin. You know, I was talking to Jay Sean, Deshaun Sykes, who's their assistant AD before the game, and we were talking about just the potential of this kid. You can see the Wilsons not in favor of Barku's judgment. Second down. Wilson. Incomplete. Now, Olu Pututau, intended receiver. On third down. Simon can't catch up with it. Tariq Thompson on coverage. And some more heat again on Zach Wilson. Fourth down with only 4.53 to go in regulation, which against this defense is like a minute left. I mean, you have to go. Well, it's not even a choice, I don't no, think, at this flesh. point. Uh, because of the time of possession advantage that San Diego State has sixth in the country in time of possession so right now if you're Wilson you've got to go to Matt Bushman so let's see where he's at there's Bushman at the number three position Bushman has to show up now must have for Wilson to BYU intercepted 
Tariq Thompson with a pick for San Diego State. And the exclamation point on this lockdown brick wall defense of the Aztecs. What an effort tonight for San Diego State's team. Late stages of the fourth quarter now, and BYU had one last chance to stay in the game. Cougars from their four. Micah Simon has the catch, and Hall has the tackle. First time all year, they didn't have the incentive of playing for a division championship. How would they respond? Pretty well, I'd say. Wilson avoids the pressure, and out of bounds in front. Can he create magic here? with just under three minutes to go. Yeah, no timeouts. Shovel pass, Bushman made the one-handed catch. That was a no-look point guard type feed there. <laughs> Full Keyshawn Banks there. On second down, Wilson. Lozino all over him, throwing for Talon Shumway. It's incomplete. Wouldn't have been a problem as long as you reestablish yourself in bounds. So it's third down for Wilson, throws on the move again. A great catch, Shumway. They got to they got to pick up the urgency, Dave. If you're trying to win this game, you can't just walk around. You got to hurry up and get to the line of scrimmage. It's a great catch, a, a, a good effort by Barku. But if you're Zach Wilson, you got to pick up the pace. Amazing play by Talon Shumway, gain of 21 on the first down. No time to admire it. Wilson, deep ball, Shumway again with Trenton Thompson in coverage, incomplete. No timeouts. Second and ten. Wilson again facing some pressure and Micah Simon intended receiver in front of Thompson slips third down well sit here comes the heat not a good throw now you hear the catch not Box a good. gonna roll no timeouts well you didn't allow him to get out of bounds you, you almost short out the ball and now you're just walking around and I'm not sure they're not resigned to the fact the sense of urgency lacking for me too much to think they're really trying to, to really point really come with a comeback at all. Don't understand what's going on to me with this urgency. Fourth down. Pressure again. Wilson avoids the heat and hits Romney. Who's got the catch at about the 42. What an effort again from Zach Wilson. Gonna Romney to grab. Gain of 10 for the Cougars. But no timeouts. That clock is rolling. Close to a minute in the fourth. Wilson. Romney again the connection in front of Hall. And he steps out of bounds after about a, a nine yard gain. Second and two off the timeout from San Diego State. Sprint right to Zeno in pursuit. And that ball intended for Leva Hifo is out of bounds and incomplete. And 53 seconds remaining in the fourth. 12 play of the drive here. It's third down. Wilson. Bushman's got it. And Trenton Thompson's got him. Wrestles him out of bounds. But the chains move. First down. And a gain of 12. 51st attempt of the game for Wilson here. Going to run instead. Zach Wilson. Leaping tacklers. Barku trying to bring him down. Big pickup for BYU. Gets to the 10. It's precious, precious time being wasted. It, it, it really is. First down. Wilson. Feel the heat. Gets rid of it. Simon closes to it. And it's incomplete with Hall on coverage. 25 seconds left now in the fourth. Here's second down. Fee. Simon. Trying for the one hand grab. Can't bring it in. And Hall on coverage. Step for step with Micah Simon. Twenty ticks remaining here in the fourth. Give Jeff Grimes some credit. I mean, they, they've turned into a passing offense that's 29th nationally. They've thrown 20 touchdowns with three different quarterbacks. He's got his quarterback back last year. 18 out of 18 in the famous Idaho Potato Bowl a year ago against the Western Michigan team. Wilson, end zone, looking for Romney. And complete. Luke Barku, lockdown corner for San Diego State. That's what he's turned into. 
Look at the length. Look at the long arms. Look at him find the ball. Played receiver. We talked about that earlier, and this is a pretty good move here. Go ahead and get the field goal out of the way. If you can make the field goal. Well, that's the problem here. It's been a problem for this team at different points. Well, they missed one from this distance. Skyler Southam tries it again. Look out! He missed it again! Not even close. No good. And that is that from San Diego tonight. I think that's something they've got to really take a look at, Dave. I mean, you don't have a field goal kicker right now. At least not one with any confidence. And they're using Will on Tomby as the holder. They use a different holder when they go with Jake Oldroyd, excuse me. And you can see Southam's reaction. He can't believe it. Carson Baker, first career snaps. This will end well for the redshirt freshman from right here in San Diego. Takes an eight and sends the 15 seniors and coach Rocky Long out with a win tonight to finish out the regular season nine and three before their bowl game coming up. Five game win streak is over for BYU and Kalani Satake tonight for Wilson he threw for 316 by two picks and the forced fumble by Tariq Thompson 10 point win. Defense. All right, coach, you said uh, before the game that there was nothing in particular except pride on the line for this game. You weren't sure how your guys were going to show up. How proud are you of them tonight? Well, I, I think they showed up, obviously, and they played really hard. We didn't ex uh, play exceptionally well, but we played hard enough to win. And so we're pretty happy with nine wins. That's a pretty good year. You said your seniors really put the spirit back into this team, that they're a great group. You're very proud of them. What does this win mean on senior night? Well, to them, it's probably something really special, but it's special to our whole program. Uh, obviously, you always want to win, and for them to go out the way they went out tonight, uh, they'll remember it forever. State won that game 13-3 thanks to some redshirt freshmen and an out-of-this-world defensive effort against the Cougars. Thanks for watching. I'm John Schaefer. We'll see you next week on Aztec Rewind, presented by your San Diego County Toyota dealers.